Okay, so here we're going to look at some of the nerve differences in the distal limb of a bovine compared to an equine. So here the nerve that's overlying my probe is the ulnar nerve. The ulnar nerve in the bovine then splits into a dorsal branch, which we can see right here. So in the bovine, this dorsal branch comes to the dorsal aspect of the hoof as dorsal common digital nerve four. This other branch here is the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve. Okay, here we have again the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve. Now in the bovine, the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve separates just proximal to the carpus into a deep branch that's going to go deep towards the interosseous muscle, which we see right here. That's the deep branch of the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve. And then we have this branch, which is the superficial branch of the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve. The superficial branch then comes all the way down here and is going to meet up right here. So again, this is just the continuation of the superficial branch of the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve. That is going to meet up with this communicating branch, which is coming from our median nerve. So here we see the communicating branch of the median nerve coming together with the superficial branch of the palmar branch of the ulnar nerve to form palmar common digital nerve four. Now for palmar common digital nerves two and three, we just have to come here to our median nerve, which we see right here. Our median nerve descends down the limb and is going to give off palmar common digital nerve two. And a lot of times you will actually see two branches coming from the median nerve, wrapping around the median artery to form palmar common digital nerve three. You see those two nerves coming together. That's palmar common digital nerve three. Running right with palmar common digital artery three. So this branching pattern is listed on a diagram within the Canvas website. I strongly recommend you make sure you know that and then maybe bring that with you when trying to study all of the branching of the distal bovine limb.